heartbreaking. Harvey Weinstein attacked. And it's all on video. Karma. It was an excellent day for viral videos as Harvey Weinstein was attacked in an Arizona restaurant. Harvey took two shots to the face by a brave young man who must not be happy with the amount of bravado leaking out of the Shrek-like figure who allegedly sexually assaulted numerous women trying to break their way into Hollywood. The incident was recorded and found its way to TMZ, Daily Mail, and Freedom Daily. The video shows Harvey on his way out of a restaurant called Elements. It's located in the sanctuary Camelback Mountain Resort which is in Scottsdale, Arizona. At first, it was thought that Harvey was punched in the face twice with a solid fist, but the attack becomes more evident when the man responsible is shown using an open hand attack upon Weinstein's face. In other words, the man slapped the nonsense out of Harvey, something the women should have done when they encountered him and his grotesque existence. Daily Mail provided the following. TMZ reported that a man, who they identify as Steve, walked up to the disgraced movie mogul as he was leaving Elements Restaurant at the Sanctuary Camelback Mountain Resort in Scottsdale, and punched him twice. His assailant can be seen laughing while he hits Weinstein, who wore a black beanie hat and soiled gray shirt for his night out at the restaurant. The underwhelming scene plays out with Steve hastily getting out of his chair as Weinstein passes him by and then lightly hitting him with the back of his hand twice in the face. His friends can be seen grinning too at the start of the video, masking it appear as though the group had planned the charade. One of those friends sits at the table while the other holds the phone to record the scene. The video shows Weinstein's sober coach quickly usher his client past him and then hold up his hands to prevent the men from filming any more of the scene. He also tries to grab the camera out of the man's hand at one point. Harvey Weinstein allegedly participated in all those sexually charged accusations, the women were just as guilty if using it to further their career, and now we have what appears to be a street-level vigilante taking two slaps to Harvey's face. Harvey Weinstein's leaving a bar and faces an unknown adversary. The opponent slaps Harvey upside the face two times and Weinstein's sober coach tries gets involved. The coach tried to get Harvey out of the situation and possibly assaulted the person who was recording on their electronic device, phone, or camera. If anyone staged the video, then who would it be? The person who slapped Harvey? Maybe he wanted to make some extra cash selling the footage to a big news site. Maybe he wanted to inflict some street justice on an accused sexual predator. Perhaps the man wished to have the fame, the money, and the notoriety of being the alpha male who stood up for all those victims allegedly abused by Weinstein. Reports suggested that the Golden Globe Award ceremony didn't seem to invite most of the women who accused Weinstein of sexually related crimes. It was like the Golden Globe party didn't remember Harvey's alleged victims. At least this guy who slapped Harvey remembered the victims as he stood up for them that day. There's even more to the situation that involved Hollywood's mogul and a potential predator. It appears as though the manager reported that the man who slapped Harvey wanted to have his picture taken, but was denied and became angry. However, in the video, it may look different. I see a hero slapping the taste out of someone's mouth who doesn't deserve to have any taste to begin with. There's also word on the street that Rose McGowan, one of the leading accusers, is offering to give up her pricey home in the hills to pay for legal assistance. Did she mean street law or real law? There may be a few dollars worth of street level entertainment value in the video, but I don't think two open handed slaps deserve to receive a $2 million home nor does it qualify as true legal assistance. Daily Mail continued. The incident occurred just hours after Rose McGowan said she is preparing to unload her $2 million home in the Hollywood Hills to pay for the legal help she has been receiving ever since she began publicly speaking out against Weinstein. There are a few things to learn about the video of Harvey Weinstein being attacked in a restaurant. First, any bad things you do will likely come back to haunt you. This probably won't be the last attack we see. It wasn't a brutal attack, but there could be much worse on the horizon for Harvey. Second, everyone has electronic devices these days. Anytime you're getting slapped up in an eatery, then better be on the lookout for the video on the internet. Nothing escapes the internet these days.
kind of like no one escapes allegedly raping or sexually assaulting tons of women, tons of women.